thanks so much for joining me. Um, so today I'm going to show you how to do this hair. So I used a waving iron and I don't call, I, I'm going to call it a waving iron because I did a video where I did a three barrel and this one's more of a waving iron. Hang on, let me show you. So it looks like this and I don't believe I've done a video yet on this. Um, and this is the look I got. So I'm going to show you how I did this. And I hope you like the video. So if you do, please like, share, and click that bell to get notifications on my latest videos. I'm doing hair, makeup, and videos on the photography, and um, a lot more fun stuff coming for my channel. So I appreciate the support, and thank you so much, and I will show you how to do this hairstyle. Bye-bye. Hi guys, welcome back, and here is the Hotshot Tools curling iron, the waver that I was telling you about. So I'm just going to split my hair in two, and I'm going to do a light spray with some um, Lotto Body mixed with water just to set it, and a little uh, Magic Mane, which has some beautiful oils in it. Um, and I'm going to spray it with a little humidity spray, so I'll list all those tools down below. So I'm basically going to take sections, so I'm doing layers, so I'm no, I usually split my hair in two and just do the two sides. So this time I'm taking layers, so I'm doing the bottom layer, then the middle, and then the top. And it, if you can see, it does a really nice loose wave, and it's super hot. I only had this on 280, and you can see steam in some of the video. Um, now, there's a trick to how you do this. So as you can see when you watch this video, I'm using the curling iron in different directions. So that direction, I didn't love as much. But you are gonna see at one point where I take the curling iron and I reverse it, and I do it from the other way, and I found I got a better wave. So I went back in the beginning piece that you saw and redid it, and I loved it. So just be patient, you'll see it. So uh, instead of doing it in that direction, reverse it and do it the other direction, and you'll see it on the other side. You Even so, though, you can see it gives a nice wave, and it's kind of fun, kind of got a, a rock and roll kind of retro look, and it's neat because you don't have to be so perfect with it, and you can just kind of scrunch it and mess it up and give it some volume. Um, I, also, I always recommend putting in like a setting spray, a little hairspray, give it that volume, and it also helps hold it. You see a little bit of frizz, but you can get rid of that with some pomade, and it's not a big deal. Okay, so here we go. I'm going to section it, as you can see, from the bottom. And I'm just going to tie that up top, spray a little bit. Now, I'm going in sections, and this is what I mean. If you do it in this direction, I felt like I got a better wave. Um, you decide. You saw the other direction. I also got a good wave that way. Um, play with it and uh, see what works for you. All right. And you know how it is. Harry, you always feel like one side works out better than the other. It's so crazy. All right, so now we're going to do the middle section. And once again, I'm going to go in and just do like less than one inch or about a one inch in the middle piece. And I'm just moving it down. And when you look at the barrel, you can see where it kind of ends, so you know where to move it. It's pretty intuitive. At least I felt it was. And it doesn't have to be perfect because you're doing waves. You want it to be loose you don't, and kind of messy. And in some of them, they actually look perfect. So it's kind of a neat tool. I liked it. And this is definitely a fun go-to everyday tool because I don't have to be so perfect with it. I can almost wear it like a messy wave. And I did cut some more layers in my hair, so that helped. So layers help. Um, and scrunching it, giving that little volume. And there you go. You can see that really in the top wave. So I love using this curling iron in this direction, pointing out. And just like the barrel, you can see where the barrel is I was showing you. I love that. So it's got a fun look to it. I really enjoyed this tool. So I hope you guys liked this video and this helped you. If you have questions or comments, leave them below. Uh, I'm always here to help and answer. And there you go. I hope you enjoyed this. I love this look. It's like Betty Page meets Joan Jett. All right, take care, guys. And be sure to click that bell to get notifications on my newest videos. All right, enjoy. Enjoy.